Hello again, everybody. Harry Boxer, the technical trader at thetechtrader.com. It's Monday, the 12th of September. These are the charts of the day. Really good day on Wall Street, and lots of stocks were popping. Uh, I want to show you a few examples of some important breakouts. So Novus Bio, which I've been following for months now because of the base it was built, took off um, last week from around the $10 level, and within four days was $22.77 today. Now, today's blowout from 15 to 22 and three quarters finishing at 2040 up 5, 10 or 33%, came out only three quarters of a million shares. It's thin, but what I prefer to see some pullback consolidation for a week or two, and there may be a run to the mid twenties. Up next is ARQQ, which popped out of a base as well, trading 8 million shares. The biggest volume I've seen in the stock since the IPO day. Here's a stock that dropped all the way back from the mid forties down into the $5 range, built the base over the last few months and broke out. It looks to me like the next target has to be nine and a half. ASAN also um, coming out of a base that appears with big volume in the last four or five days. It's up now six days in a row, but the breakaway gap three days ago above the moving averages, which we're crossing over, now in indicates the stock's about to blow through this. You might see the stock trading in the mid 30s before not too long. Bluebird Bio, which is a tech trader swing at this point with an engulfing reversal day and a gain of just 17 cents at 2.4 percent but the highest close believe it or not the highest close since way back here in february uh even though we were up higher didn't close that day this is the highest close we've seen and i think now you're going to test eight and a quarter take it out and get it to mid-range at least nine and a half next target carvana spoke uh uh volumes to me today with a gain of 557 or 15 percent volume was uh the biggest in about four or five months trading 16.8 million Right now, I'm looking for a target at 48. Fubo. Well, we've been talking about how it was looking much better, and I had it as a chart of the day a couple of days ago. There's your breakout. There's your follow through. Right now, I'm looking for a test of five and a half and then seven. Those are your targets going forward. Gilead. Look at this breakout of a massive six, seven, eight month base pattern and a spike up today of 23 million shares, jumping 267 to 4%, but enough to get it out through resistance. Testing it, a secondary resistance at the target of 69 and backing off. If it does follow through, we'll look at the mid 70s. IDYA exploded out of nowhere with a breakaway gap and a run of 275 at 30 percent, trading 2.6 million, which is heavy volume for that stock. And now I would look for a run that te first tests 14 and then 16 and a half. INM today, big day for that stock as it exploded from. 983 to 15 to 1950 finished 1739 up 637 at 57 percent whopping 35 million traded and although it did back off resistance your next target has to be in the high 20s let's see if it can consolidate without too much damage i went q popped out of a falling worse today there's your breakout it's popping 49 cents or nine percent Traded 3.6 million. Now your target has to be for six and a half and then seven and a half. LABU edged higher, but I believe that based on the breakout and the consolidation of the last couple of days, any further upside, we're going to see 13, first 11, then 13, 13 and a quarter. Beyond that, high teens. Lucid, nice comeback today after a, a kind of a big pullback from almost 22 down back down and almost in half to 13. 65 it just jumped today uh jumping 10 percent or dollar 50 and you can see the way it looks like it's right at the climbing tops line but the successful test of the lows now the reversal had me thinking the stock has got some energy to move into the 1820 zone mcrb is nice biotech with a reversal big time at 250 back in june mid-june is, is almost triple to seven 719 was a high today finished 699 uh, resistance the next target is seven and three quarters and eight and a half neo pop as well big spike of uh 18 and a half to 2188 finished 2166 up 250 or 13 percent very heavy volume 90 million the biggest in three months acting like it and it closing right near resistance it should pop and break through your next target is at resistance near 25. pacb edging higher now up for Five days in a row at resistance. Should we break out here? And today was an inside day. We break out looking for nine and a quarter and at 14. 
plug four days in a row now up with the tail leaving it. This looks solid. A test of 31 and a half should lead to a breakout and a run to 36. RBBN exploded today, but backed off. But it took out a quadruple top and a base pattern before pulling back. I think it's likely we see more upside targeting four and a quarter and five. Roblox up now four days in a row. It says the tech trade is swing. I'm looking for more upside. Looking, I think 53 is a good target. RXT, long downtrend, may have reversed. Today was a big spike up, going from 514 to 645, finishing just six cents off the high. At 639, up 107 or 20%. Buying was the best I've seen in this stock going back to March of last year. So a really nice pop. Now there's a double top resistance here across this zone that tells me if we get, and that's your target, about seven and a half. If we get through that, we might see nine. RYTM continues to be one of the best swings we gave you all year. From the mid single digits, it's it's gone up fivefold to 2729, pulled back for four weeks, now breaking out again. Today's pop 316 to 13.5%. The next target is mid range at 34, followed by the upper target in the low 40s. SRTS, a new one, put a swing on it today. Love the long term chart. Made a new all time high a month ago, pulled back and had a beautiful coil and broke out. Volume's picking up. I think the stock's headed for 19 and then 22. And finally, Uber, one of our swing trades with an engulfing reversal day, down to 30.68, up to 32.93, finished 32.50. Only up 72 cents, but key of enough reversal that I think it's going to take out 33.36. The next target is near 38. That's it. And a look at the techtrader.com hot stocks. HB out. Have a good evening.